it's so important to, to maintain that fitness level and you know a professional sportsman needs to go back into training and they need to go back into training at the right level. Um, if you, you can detrain so easily, especially when the, the, the more elite an athlete you are, the, the, the faster you will detrain. And so that's why it's quite important that we try and think of all the different ways of, of, of continuing their CV fitness. Now, that brings with it its own problems because you, what you don't want to do is make the injury worse. So you have to have a good knowledge of the injury. You also have to have a good knowledge of what CV, you know, what muscles are used by the different types of cardiovascular uh, equipments that there are out there, CV equipments, because you mustn't, you know, what you don't want to do is regress, but you want to maintain, and that's quite a balance, and that's quite a hard balance to find at times. And I think everyone would say, sometimes you get it right and sometimes you get it wrong. Sometimes they don't go back fit enough. Sometimes they regress during the rehab because you've tried to push them and push them and push them and push them. Now, every professional sportsman wants to go out and and run immediately. They want to get out and, and get on with it, you know. And that's that's the difficulty: is holding them back and not overdoing it, but making sure that as soon, you know, when when they go back into training, they don't look out of place. And I think that's quite important. And that that is probably half of the battle. I think when and 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 that's half the art in terms of doing professional, you know, uh, physiotherapy within professional sport is getting that balance right.